With the name of God, most gracious, most merciful, and in the presence of our ancestors, both seen and unseen. Ladies and gentlemen, before explaining libations and recording libations, I'd like to make a presentation. Last week, I was 11,000 feet above sea level in the Rockies with the highest ranking of Khan priestess in this country, as well as 20 other high priests and priestesses of various African traditional religions. And we had an opportunity to pray and bless some hawk feathers. And with that, I'd like to present to Renee, on behalf of the 21 of us who were in the Rockies, a blessed and sanctified hawk feather to be displayed somewhere not too conspicuous within the Black Cultural Center. And it reads, may the spirit of the hawk, Heru, forever guide this center, peace and love, Nasheed. So we'd like to present a blessed and sanctified hawk. It's upon the shoulders of Mother Earth that this great culture center stands. Amongst our ancestors and traditional people, we understood that death was not the end, but death was only a transition. That the bonds you make in this life are not destroyed by time and space. All of us have relatives in other states and other lands, and because we have not seen them in weeks, so to either write them a letter, think of them, or pick up the phone and call. Well, amongst our ancestors, we knew that death was not the end. Death was only a transition and that we have ancestors on the other side of this dispensation. And libations, the ritual point of libations of water into the earth is the way we pick up the phone to the other side. The way we pick up the phone and let grandmama know, grandmama, you still in my heart and I still love you. The way we let that son or that daughter know that, baby, you're still with me and I love you. We pour water to you. We pour cool water. We ask that peace and harmony go with your journey. And that's what we will do today. We will pour libations into Mother Earth and ask her and ask the spirits and ask the great creator to bring and allow our ancestors to continue to guide our lives. So with you, if you will endure me, I want to come to the center there. And I'd like uh, to pour libations there. Ladies and gentlemen, if you will stand in respect of the ancestors, and I will kneel, and the brother will hold the mic to my, to my, uh, to my mouth. Father, Mother God, we know you by so many names. We know you as Jesus Christ. We know you as Lord and Savior. We know you as Ola Gamali. We know you as Ola Kun. We know you as Allah. We know you as Jah. We know you as Amin Ra. We know you as Fatah. We know you as Wonkin Tonkin. We know you as Tonka Sheila. We know you as Lord Shiva. Father, Mother God, we pour these libations to you, Ashe. We pour these libations to the first male and female principal that stood up in the Aldabai Gord and began to navigate 4,160 miles of the Nile, giving birth to civilization in Ethiopia and Egypt. Ashe. We pour these libations to those noble souls that circumnavigated 24,896 miles around the earth, giving knowledge and wisdom wherever they went. We pour libations to them. Ashe. Ashe. We pour libations to those Africans who were captured in Central Africa and marched from Central Africa to the west coast of Africa, held in slave dungeons for up to a year. We pour these libations to them for their faith, determination, and tenacity. Ashe. Ashe. We pour these libations to those Africans who were stuffed in the halls of slave ships and made to endure the arduous journey across the Atlantic. Those Africans that endured the Middle Passage. Those Africans who were strong and noble and firm of character. We pour libations to you, Ashe. Ashe. And all we pour libations to all of those Africans who were deposited all along the east coast of America, all throughout the Caribbean, all throughout Brazil. We pour libations to you, Ashe. Ashe. And all you great African mama, oh mama, you who stopped and gave birth to me in the cotton fields of Mississippi, you mama who gave birth to me to the, in the peanut fields of Georgia, oh you mama who gave birth to me
to me in the sugar cane fields of Louisiana, in the tobacco fields of Kentucky. Oh, you great mama, I pour a libation to you and thank you for giving me the love under those conditions I shake. And you great African father, you father who went to the hanging tree as a man and stood as a man, and also you father who bowed down that I could be here today pouring these libations. I pour libations to you, I shake. And all, oh, 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 my Native American ancestors, we pour libations to you, the noble people who took us in as we sought to establish the maroon villages. You, Native American people, the Choctaw, the Chickasaw, the Cherokee, the Lakota, the Crow, the Blackfoot, the Seminole, we pour libations to you, Ashe. We pour libations to those European ancestors who came and fought to eradicate slavery and Jim Crowism. Those European ancestors who made this country a strong country and gave up their lives. We pour libations to them, Ashe. Father, Mother, God, we pour libations now to all of our personal ancestors. All those ancestors who've gone on before us, we pour libations to them and ask that you, Father, Mother, God, out of your mercy, allow them to descend and come and not only guide our lives, guide the direction of this black cultural center and guide the direction of Purdue University. We ask you, Father, Mother, God, out of your mercy, allow our ancestors to come and watch over us. We thank you and we pour libations to all of our ancestors, known and unknown. Ashe. You may be seated. Thank you. In about two months and the plaque reads as follows founded in 1969 as part of the university's response to sweeping social change the Purdue Black Cultural Center has grown and matured into a focal point for African for the African-American experience and <laughs> you want me to cut Mark? Okay. Mark? Yeah. and you can keep the ribbons as souvenirs Breaking down. Thank you. In the clock. Oh, yeah. Thank you. The ribbon will be distributed as souvenirs. Again, thank you for joining us in this dedication event.